Uh, just a quick video to show the Sergeant and Greenleaf 6651 and what effect the roller nose has on contact point readings and what I do uh, when I'm manipulating a 6651. Uh, you can see there the roller on the end of the lever and every time you come off of the contact point it's in just a hair different position and it is eccentric so it changes your contact point readings so what I do when I'm manipulating one is I will run over the contact point a time or two either the right or the left depending on which one seems to be moving at the most and I will look to find my highest reading All right there we're at about uh, 4.7 fuzz lower four six and a half right at four five about four four Mm, about four or two there, maybe one. Oh, we're on a flat four there. In fact, leaning just a little bit into the threes, but not enough to call a lower digit. Now we're coming back up. Yeah, we're at about uh, 4.7. Maybe 4.8. Yeah, it's coming back down a little bit. Let's go over this contact point. That's a good 4.9, maybe almost a 5. So you see the difference it makes on this lock. It makes a 0.8 or a 0.9 difference. So every time you take a reading of your contact point, you've got to do that and then find either the highest or the lowest. It doesn't matter which, as long as you're consistent. And use either the highest or the lowest reading every time.